What's going on YouTube? BD King 721. Got a special video for you today. I mentioned last week in my other video that I would show you the cards that came in from comc.com uh, when they did come in and I also have all my chrome from 2013 here in the office that I'm going to uh, show you some of those as well. Uh, what I have in front of you right now is a package from Beckett.com that I had a trade, made a trade, and then this is the uh, package I got from ComC.com with all the most recent purchases I made there. And in the back, I have uh, my Chrome. Let's see, I actually can't see it here, but it's right there is my set of 2013 Tops Chrome Blue with three of my better cards that I've gotten over the last year or so from opening boxes and cases of Topps Chrome. Uh, my three best autos that I figure. Uh, just recently got this Carlos Martinez Black. I'm not really sure. I haven't looked up what he's been doing this year, whether he's in the majors or, or what his situation is, actually. But I know he's a good talent. Obviously, the Mike Trout. You've all seen that awesome video I made about I don't know, four or five months ago. And then the case hit that I got in one of the cases I pulled, this Avicel Garcia Camo Auto, numbered out of 15? Yeah, numbered out of 15. And then behind you has got the shoe box. Behind that's got the shoe box here, filled with some of the uh, chrome cards that I have, either either getting ready to start my new sets or just duplicates. So I'll go through those as well. So I don't want to make this too long of a video, guys, but uh, bear with me. Just going to open up my package here from the trade I made. Looks like the guy sent me a couple golden giveaway cards. I'm not sure if these have been redeemed or not, but I'll check them out. So first off, I got this really cool Emerald Jed Jerko uh, Topps Rookie card. Goes into that PC for Jerko, Bowman Platinum, and a another Bowman Platinum as well, Top Prospects. Then I traded for the Sergio Romo Sepia for 2013 Chrome. And this 2012 rookie card blue of Cespedes. So pretty cool. I really needed that before I got to start doing that set as well. Or finishing that set and a couple more uh, giveaway cards. Or actually three more giveaway cards. Let's check those out. So that was the trade I made. And then the real great thing that I got was this package from comc.com. If you haven't checked them out, definitely go check them out. Highly recommend them either as a buyer or seller. Uh, kind of an addicting site because it has pretty much everything that you can imagine. So they package things up really well as you can see. Mini box in there and then they've got these little peanuts with the packaging slip. So in here, over the last month or two, since the last time I did a video for you showing the cards I got from this site, these are all the cards that I've purchased on their site over the last few months. They package it up really nice. They ship everything in a penny sleeve and in boxes that you can see that really keep it really nice and protected. So as you can see, here's a good one right off the bat, Jose Fernandez. And then I threw in a few other year, other products. Here's a Miguel Montero and a Aramas Ramirez blue from last year. But everything else is going to be mostly blue. Here's a Jeter, Profar, Kershaw. Here's a couple of different ones. Here's a black Rodney, a black Feliz, a black Duda, Hayward there. These are all cards I needed for my set. And is, here's a Romero from 2011 for my set back, back then. 
These are all cards I need. Here's a Lester from 2012. And as you know from my previous videos, I only need one card to complete this set. That's Darvish. I have to go through these myself and remind myself what I actually bought. I lose track over time. And then one card in here that's kind of interesting. This 2011 Topps Chrome Sepia of Cliff Lee. That brings me down to four. I need four of these. And I'll be able to say that I have that complete set. So 2011, I'm really close on the Sepia. And I only need one on the Atomic. That's the Strasbourg. I haven't found those yet. So in this box, this is how I keep my sets. Right on the top, there's Mr. Puig that I got the other day. Keep him in a, in a hard case so that he'll be better protected. But as you can see, here are all the blues. Keep them all in this nice, uh, everything is in penny sleeves and in these boxes. This is a 400 count box. And once I get all of, once I get all of these cards into here, it'll fit really nice and snug. Then, as you can see, I do have these guys for autos. Oh, there's my phone. I'll let that go. Can't be that important. These are extras that I have, if anybody's interested. Jim Johnson, Didi Gregorius, Ben Zobris, Cliff Lee, Reddick, Cespedes, Hunter Pence, Perez, Mesa, Lutz, Paco, Odorizzi, Beltre, Webster, Peavy, and then Blacks, I have Martin, Grinky, Straley, Reyes, Cespedes, Barnes, Price, Rutledge, Upton, and Davis. And then one sepia that I have duplicate is uh, Azubal, Azubal Cabrera. These are redemptions that I'm still waiting for. A couple of Gibsons, a Nick Franklin, Arcia, and a Gold Arcia. So a couple of good ones coming in there. These are all for trade for sale, the ones I'm showing you now. All my autos and other lower numbered cards. I got a Gallardo, Dickey, Franklin, Victorino. These are Atomics numbered to 10. The Camos, I got Price, Kelly, Rondon, Upton numbered to 15. And then all the autos I have that are extras. Kelly, Jerko, another blue, these are Sepia. Then you got Blue Jerko, Kelly Jerk. Um, Kelly Blue, then Refractors, I got Maurer, Marte, and then Base Autos are all these, Singrani, Eaton, Arenado, Webster, Marte, Familia, I've got four of them, Odorizzi, Brantley, i got two, Hecheveria, and Rondon, and Skaggs, another couple of Kellys, and a Mirande. Sorry if that wasn't in focus all that well. But next, I will be starting my, I'm not sure exactly which set I'm going to concentrate on now, but there, here's some of the lower numbered refractors, Pence, Feliz, Wheeler, and then I've got Gold Pence, Kane, Frazier, Gonzalez, and Price. Those guys are for trade for sale. They'll be tough to get off me. I'm not going to make those sets, but then I have the sepia started here. These are all sepias that I'm going to start with the set and then in here I've got the rest of the sepia and the blacks sitting in here waiting to go as far as my sets go as far as far as the next sets go so I won't go through all those I will once I start doing that set I probably will start doing this set next this is the 2012 blue um, I got to keep going even though I don't complete something I still got to keep going on other ones so if you have any of those or any chrome refractor set items let me know hope you enjoyed that sorry for the long video and I will uh, talk to you guys soon see ya